Mid Journey 5 is really killing it at the moment with many of the images generated by Mid Journey going viral on the web. You surely have seen them on many news outlets. Well, Mid Journey 6 is coming really soon and many of the features have been leaked by one of the testers. Before I go into it, please take a couple of seconds of your time to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification button to not miss any of my upcoming videos with tutorials and news about the new AI text to image tools. So what's coming with the new Mid Journey 6? I have to shout out to Nick Pierre for the info that he shared us first. He's within a small group of people testing a future version of Mid Journey 6. Mid Journey 6 is likely to be released sometimes in May and he is currently testing the alpha version and he's quite amazed about it. As you know at the moment Mid Journey 5 has a lot of speed issues. It is often stuck. That's because it's working on Discord and they are currently having issues on Discord. Well, the good news is that a web interface is definitely coming within the next one, two months. That info comes from Nick Pierre. He's currently testing that alpha version and said it's very, very good. He also shared some info about the general roadmap for Mid Journey. Some of those features I will mention now will come with version 6 and some with the version 7 and 8 coming later this year. So let's walk through the list. There will be new in-painting feature. In-painting feature lets you erase and replace some parts of a picture. There will be a new out-painting feature that lets you expand the image you currently have. There will be a new higher resolution image tool on version 6. There is no info about how large the images will become, but uh, some wide speculation is that at least twice the size we will get that, but uh, maybe even more. There will be finally new text support coming probably with version 7 or 8. As you know, currently with Midjourney struggles with text on images. It often creates a mess. With version 7 or 8, this problem will be nearly solved. There will be a new mobile app and a new web interface. And probably this is coming in May with new Midjourney 6 version. There will be new real-time drawing and what's even more important, a new API tool. But Midjourney, of course, is not only working on new features, but is also working to improve the things that are working good right now. They want to make images look better, make, making things go faster, and also making images higher quality. And to end this video, I will share the last info about a completely new feature Midjourney is working on on the long term. Nick Pierre writes that Midjourney is going towards 3D called Liquid Imagination and the future is not one image a minute but 60 FPS full volumetric 3D. But please keep in mind that this is not a feature that is coming very soon. They are working on it, thinking about it and it's more likely that it will be released sometimes in 2024. This is it as of today. Please subscribe to this channel, hit the notification button and I see you soon for my next video.